finally talking about sport and about the return of international cricket to Pakistan, which is starting. Sri Lanka have been, Bangladesh um, have been. How long till we see an England tour of Pakistan, do you think? Well, uh, two, 2019 was the safest year in Pakistan since 9-11. Problems started in Pakistan after 9-11 and then after 2006, foreign cricket teams stopped coming to Pakistan because of uh, a security situation. Yeah, there was the attack on the Sri Lankan team. So, uh, the, there were New Zealand were there when there was an attack and, uh, and so the cricket teams disappeared and the investors disappeared. So we went through a really terrible time uh, during this war on terror. And I'm really happy to say that 2019 was the safest year since then and a lot of uh, uh, countries now have uh, removed their travel advisors to Pakistan. I asked uh, President Trump too that U.S. also should remove their travel advisor to, to our country. Uh, tourism doubled in one year in 2018-19. Tourism doubled in Pakistan because now the country is safe. So I expect foreign teams to come soon. Can you imagine welcoming the Indian team? I hope, you know, the saddest thing for me is that I reached out to India immediately after I became Prime Minister because I know India and I had such friendships and I just, you know, for, for years have been, uh, got love and respect in India and I thought I would reach out to them and, you know, if two countries, if we start trading with each other, it's the best way to fight poverty. But unfortunately, and I say sadly, India has been taken over by this extreme ideology. And people in India will suffer as much as, say, the people in Kashmir are suffering. Because whenever, I repeat, whenever such an ideology takes over, it always leads to bloodshed. I think that's a no, then, to welcoming an, an India team. I know it's but, hard to but, imagine in a moment but, like this. But, this, but hopefully, maybe uh, uh, another election you know, would change things.